Hey there, I just want to say thank you first of all for allowing us to make this video for you and send it to you. My name is Joelle and I'm with Zoe SEO and Web Design. Basically, I'm going to show you the three main things Google is looking for when a search is made for electrical services in Los Angeles or Glendale. Um, this will help you to begin to outrank your competitors on Google, ultimately bring in those customers and that revenue from the use of your website here. You're probably wondering why I'm making this video for you. I'm also a small business owner. I've learned that, you know, you're probably way too busy taking care of your customers to learn about how to make the internet and your website bring in more customers. And, and so I know that the main thing probably stopping you from hiring someone is that you don't know who to trust, who the expert is and that sort of thing. So I found out when I'm able to create these videos, show you um, a little bit of strategy and what we are capable of doing, that um, you can take what I've shown you, you can do it yourself, or you can, um, you know, allow us to do it for you. So um, whatever you choose to do is totally cool with me, although I'd love to be the expert and do it for you. I just want to help however I can. In this video, I'm going to talk about the three main things involved with search engine optimization or SEO. These are content, backlinks, and citations. Emble implementing these three components will be what gets those potential customers to your site. Now, the first thing we need to do is make sure you have a lot of content. So um, I don't know if your your page is fairly new or or what, but you definitely know, need a lot more content. I don't see any service pages, any um, service areas or anything like that. So I would love to help you um, build up your website. You definitely need to build up your website with the necessary content, first of all. Uh, once you get more content than your competitor, you will blow them out of the water. And generally, uh, the average website that ends up on the first page of Google will have 1,500 to 2,000 words of content. This is all the text, titles, images um, on your pages. So within the content, you'll want to make sure that you have the buyer intent search terms or keywords. A keyword is just a phrase someone types into Google. Buyer intent means they need the service and they're not just wanting to look at an image or learn about something. So if I try to search electrician, um, let's see, let's not do the greater Los Angeles area. Let's do electrician Glendale. Okay. Um, first of all, it looks like you don't even have the word electrician. So, you know, this is, um, yeah, well, this is a buyer intent keyword, and this is what somebody's going to be searching for when they're wanting to find an electrician um, in your area. So um, you'll want to add this necessary key phrase a couple of times. And um, electrician Glendale, Glendale electrician, electrician Los Angeles, wherever you want to serve, whatever areas you want to serve in. You can also save the titles and the descriptions of your pages and your images as keywords. It will all help you rank. So your content is number one. Definitely building up that content. And so I would love to help you with your website. Um, that's definitely what we do. And then uh, the number two aspect that you really need to pay attention to is called backlinks. Backlink is when another website is linking to your website, driving traffic to you. This is really important. Google ranks your value on the authority of those other websites that they give you. Google wants to see a bunch of trustworthy companies vouching for your company. Keep in mind, though, they want to see relevant links, which means it will give you a lot more power if you have another um, electrical company or construction company linking to you than a bet like a a uh, Bed Bath & Beyond. <laughs> so the tool I use to see how a website is ranking in Google is called Arefs. And um, I've already put your information in here. This tool allows me uh, to see how many keywords you are ranking for and the amount of backlinks your website has. And um, currently you have six websites linking to you giving power to 10 backlinks. Now, when I when I searched electrician in Glendale, uh, the electrical connection came up in the top section, and um, this top competitor here has 
485 websites linking to them, giving power to 10,000 backlinks. So what you want to do is copy them. If these websites linking to them are good enough to get them to the top, then they are good enough for you. Just visit all 485 of these websites, put a link, um, your URL, basically this right here on each of these websites and um, that links back to your home page and most of the time you can just create a profile and add a link in the profile or put a comment somewhere so then if you add your URL to all of these other websites and add the necessary content and more relevant backlinks this is how you will beat your competitor on Google search organically now um, this is uh, the search results for Electrician and Glendale. If you want to be beat your competitor with the um, Google Ads, you'll need to bid higher than your competitor. And if you want to be at the top of this Google Maps section, which is basically Google My Business says optimized, then you'll need to have more citations than your competitor. A citation is anywhere where your business name, addresses, and phone number is listed in a different directory. Directories. A directory is a website like Yelp, Yext, Yellow Pages, White Pages, Facebook, Angie's List. There are hundreds, and um, they will allow you to list your information. Find out where your competitors are listed, then add your business's information to more directories than they have. If they're listed in 150 directories, then you should be listed in 300. So this is just a quick overview of what content, backlinks, and um, uh, citations will do for you. I hope you found it helpful and informative. I tried to keep it short and to the point. As a quick recap, uh, you'll want to have about 1,500 to 2,000 words of content on your home page here. You want to have um, more websites linking to your, your, um, your website than your competitor. So you, you want to have more websites than this guy. And if you put your name, address, and phone number in more directories than uh, these top three right here, then you're going to be in the top of the search results for Google. If you follow these tips, this is how you'll become number one. I recommend you get started as soon as possible. It does take time, and um, the sooner you get started, the sooner you'll start profiting from your website. So if you have any questions or you would like, to have someone else basically do it for you, just give me a call. My phone number is at the bottom of the email. And if I'm not already looking or working with an electrician in the area that you wanna rank for, then I would be more than happy to help you out. All I ask is that you please just respond to the email, give me a little bit of feedback and let me know what you thought of this video. Thank you so much and I look forward to hearing from you.